Hi, this is Cal with WaldingOutfitter.com. You're talking about the Fronius Trans Steel 2200. So the first thing about this machine is it's very light, 33 pounds. Uh, pretty easy to move around if you need to move it anywhere. Um, that's great because it is 110 and 220. So if you have 110 in your house or in a shop, you can use it there. And if you need to go up to a bigger power source and get a little bit more thickness out of it, you can do that. Um, so first we're gonna plug it in. Here's the cord, it's kind of a quick connect cord on here. So, just flip it around, take this, stick it in and turn it, it's on, and you just flip the switch. So we're looking at the face plate here on the Trans Steel 2200. As you can see, there's three different sets of switches here off the front. So it's just saying steel, stainless, CUSI, ALMG, AL Silicon, Rutil, which is 71 wire, metal cord and self-shielded so if you click through here it starts saying no program and that's just saying because these other settings aren't correct for what you're on so if you go to steel which is what most people do then you set your diameter of wire right here so 030 let's say and then you gotta pick your uh, gas type so the top one is argon 100% so there's no program because that doesn't run well with steel 100% CO2 it's saying there is a program for that um, and that's just because, uh, you know, 100% CO2, usually uh, a lot of people don't use it because it, there's a lot of splatter. With this machine, there's a limited amount of splatter when you do 100%, which can save you some money on argon. And then uh, 25 or 2 to 5% argon to CO2, uh, again, no program because that's not good for the weld quality. And then 25%, which is what most people use, is 75-25 mix, it has a program in for it. So the other cool thing about this is it is synergic. So you see when I turn this, it changes uh, the voltage and the amperage at the same rate. Um, so if you think you need it a little bit hotter, you can turn it up, but then it switches this. That is a feature that can be turned off, um, but uh, just comes standard here on the Tronius 2200. In closing, the Tronius Trans Steel 2200 is a great welder for any home hobbyist or light fabricator. Um, it, is, it has 60 pre-programmed settings for GMAW, so if there's anything that you're thinking you might do but you don't know how to do it, it is programmed on here most likely. Um, you can just go through the settings. Uh, there is a book that comes with it as well. If you have questions, you can always give us a call. Uh, the last thing that I want to point out is this welder uh, does run, run on 110 and 220 as I said before. Uh, one of the neat features of this welder is it can run on 300 foot of extension cord without tripping the breaker. Uh, it has some smart technology in here that can kind of sense the amperage uh, that's coming out of the breaker. Um, thank you for stopping by and have a great day.